Bicycles. I've been riding ever since I was five. I used to uh, ride in uh, BMX uh, local circuits. Uh, had a few, uh, won a few competitions and had a few trophies. After my BMX years, I went on to a road bike, and I had a Pujo uh, 10 speed that I had for a number of years. But when I moved to the city, I needed a bike that was easier to fix, easier to maintain, and just easier to build, so I switched to fixed gear. I've been riding a fixed gear for four years now. I guess the best quality is the simplicity of it, really. Um, I, I mean, you, you, you could use it without any brakes. I have a front brake only because um, I'm a little <laughs> reckless sometimes, so I need a front brake. But you could ride it no brakes. It's Super easy to build, uh, not many parts. It's, it's a simple bike, so a simple bike to, you know, inexpensive compared to road bikes and other bikes. Fixed gear culture is uh, pretty intense, I would say. They're, I wouldn't say militant, but they do have uh, certain rules, like there's the brakeless fixed gear riders, no brakes at all. And sometimes they'll kind of like poke a little fun at you if you have like a front brake, whatever. And if you have two brakes, then forget it. But I would say that it's a, although a little militant at times, it's very united. Like, you know, you show up to the rides, everyone just knows you, everyone's down with you, it's cool with you. So the fixed gear culture in New York is just like one big dysfunctional family. <laughs> But yeah, you know, everyone's cool. I mean, a lot cooler, a lot more humble than BMX or road bike, at least in my experience.
right now my beater bike, what they call a beater bike, that, you know, the bike that will just get you to and from wherever you need to go and it's kind of cheap and if it gets stolen or damaged, it's not a big deal. So right now it's just my little beater until I work myself up towards my future build. My name is David Rodebaugh, I run Affinity Cycles. I've been riding my whole life. I mean, started out when I could walk, pretty much when I could walk. I, I, my parents bought me a little, what was it? It was like a 12 inch Ninja Turtles Huffy bike. Started taking that off little wood jumps and busting my eyes open and, and breaking bones and I've been doing it since. Um, been riding a fixed gear for probably 10, 12 years. Uh, I've been here in New York three and a half years worked on and off as a messenger as well as a mechanic and many other things, but mainly mainly as a mechanic and shop manager. I love it, man. That's why I'm here. That's why I'm a part of it. That's why I do so much with it. Um, it's it's like a, a family outside of a family. It's, uh, it's pretty awesome. I mean, everyone looks out for everyone and it's a pretty tight-knit group of people. I mean, there's, there's tons of new people to the scene and and that are interested in fixed gears and, and working as a messenger, just being around out and about. Riding a bike in a city like this is awesome. It's one of the best ways to see the city. So.